Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's Mike here at Game From Scratch, and today we have the final day of the Humble Bundle reruns. These are best-selling bundles throughout the year. They brought them back for two days only. We've done a number of game development bundles, and we're finally at the end. We're going out with probably the most universally useful asset bundle of the year, and that is the Decagon Townscape Essentials Unreal Asset Humble Bundle. It is a huge collection, 2,000 plus assets of just stuff. Stuff that you need to populate a city. By the way, stuff that is exceptionally easy to export out of Unreal Engine and into other game meshes because it's almost all static meshes. Makes it super, super simple to get it into Godot or Unreal or anything like that. Generally a one-click process. And I've got some guides down below that will teach you how. So you can see here you've got a number of different um, assets in this one. Now what you're going to find is in the rerun, there are no tiers. There is just a $25 tier with everything in it. And you're going to notice there is a ton of, well, stuff. Vending machines, knickknacks furniture, uh, then we've got, um, you know, doors, and then we got a couple of uh, environments like the police headquarters that I used for the thumbnail. We've got some cars in here, uh, bathrooms, bedrooms, interiors, exteriors, uh, commercial stuff, wi awnings, windows, blinds, you name it, it's got it in this bundle. So let's just actually just go through and take a look at some of the contents in this bundle. Now, first off, this bundle redeems on your uh, fab store that used to be Unreal Engine Marketplace. So you're going to find basically everything here under Decagon. Uh, this is not all from this particular bundle, but a ton of it actually is. So you see here, just these universally useful things for populating a city with stuff, realistic stuff. So if you have a game that needs to have stuff in it, <laughs> this is a useful bundle for you. So let's go check out some of said stuff. So uh, first we've got things here like air pipes and vents. Again, it's the kind of stuff that you just need to populate your world with. It's just, it's not fun to model. It's the perfect kind of thing to actually buy uh, in an asset bundle like this because it's not asset flippy. This is a recreation of real world stuff that you will need to model at some point, but you use it to create your own scenes. After that, we've got here the electric air props. So again, things like air compressors, air conditioners, fans, and so on, hot water heaters, radiators, and so on. Again, stuff you need in your world. After that, we have basically background buildings. These are really low polygon buildings to populate the background of your city. Number of different options there. And then we've got things like signs. So you need going out of business or 90% off or loading dock or various different signs that you need in your world. Warning for cameras, backing up dock, so on and so forth. There is a ton of science. Again, bathrooms and so on. Um, next up, we have, and then interestingly enough, boiled peanuts. <laughs> which seems very random. Uh, then we've got a number of city signs, so, you know, stop signs and street signs and so on. We've got some uh, lettering. You can create your own town's name. Here you can see they've created as Meridian. You create it as whatever you want. Then you got things in here like mailboxes and guardrails and transistors and uh, hydro lines and so on. Again, it's just stuff that you need to populate your world. Uh, a number of things fully modeled, ready to go. Uh, then we've got some vehicles. There's uh, two or three asset packs for vehicles. So here you can see um, different low polygon cars you can populate your world with. Uh, we got backyard props, things like gazebos and barns and sheds and so on. Um, then we've got a number of houses. So if you need houses in your world, hey, they got you covered here as well. So again, everything you need to create and populate a city is in this bundle. Then we got attachments, things like these exhaust vents and um, mailboxes and fire extinguishers. Uh, again, universal useful stuff. And you're going to notice here you got custom numbers again for doing the street signs for each different house. Uh, then you got receptacles, plugs, switches, and so on. Again, it is just all of the generalistic stuff that you need to create a game world. Again, probably one of the most generally universally useful bundles that has ever been. Here you can see a number of doors. These are internal doors. There, oh no, these are external doors. There is another one for internal doors as well. There's one for industrial. Uh, so again, things that you need. And then we've got covers and awnings. I feel like I did this one already, uh, or at least some of it looks like we've already cooked. No, no, I guess this is all new. So a number of different awnings for populating in your world. Uh, then we've got fences. There is about four different fence packs in this one. So you can see here you got stone wall fences, um, more advanced fences, wrought iron fences, and so on. Uh, both available in Nanite and low poly. So if you need high detail or low detail, they got you covered. And then we've got groceries. So you've got things like hairbrushes and spam called PAMs, uh, and then cereals and then liquors and so on. So again, the stuff that you need to populate in your world inside of the, um, the shelves, etc., that might exist. And we got your laundry. Uh, again, number of laundry items. 
and then we've got uh, washing machines and so on as well. Uh, then we've got things for the bathroom. So you hear a number of bathtubs and sinks and toilets and baths and showers and then accessories that go on the wall. And then you've got your toiletries like toilet paper, hair dryers, towels, and so on. And then we've got trash because what city would be uh, you, um, complete without, well, trash. And there's a ton of trash. It's just very useful once again. And then we've got stuff you put on your walls, paintings, pictures, this guy. Uh, so yeah, you got a ton of different art to hang up on your walls to make it look more useful. Here you can see the backs of them all. Um, and then we've got vending machines and services. So these are things like ice machines and uh, old timey pop machines and uh, foam booths and gas stations and arcade machines and so on. The only thing I would say here is it's very much of the time. So you've got a lot of things that are very 80s and 90s in the look and wear to them. And then finally, we've got one environment here, which I use for the thumbnail. And this is the 1996 police headquarters. So again, it does all have a very 90s vibe, but you can see how you could use all of this together to populate your world. So it really is a townscape essentials, a ton of different bundles for things. Again, cars, signs, roadside, small structures, houses, window decor, attachment doors, commercial doors, pipes, uh, fences, grocery stuff, a number of different lighting setups there, that being literal lighting, like lamps and so on. Uh, then we got a number of different things, bathrooms, bedrooms, uh, retro cars again, hitches and trailers, more cars, uh, trash for your streets, uh, toys, electronics, rugs, interior decor, knickknacks, you name it, it is here. By the way, there are a number of guides that will talk you through how to actually get these things out of Unreal Engine and into your game. But it's a, a banger of a bundle if you just basically have a real world environment. It just gives you a huge leg up and for 25 bucks, it's pretty insane what you're getting here. So that is the final of the bundles. By the way, if you use my link, it does help support Game From Scratch and I very much appreciate it. If you have a trouble with that link, it's probably Ublock Origin Humble switched the way they do their links. And sadly, Ublock does not like it. Just paste it in a new tab and it should work just fine. All right, so that is it with the spam of Humble videos. I think we are at the end. Anything from this point on is basically going to be a normal Humble that very happened very periodically. None of this daily stuff. So let me know what you think of the Decagon Townscape Essentials Unreal Asset Humble Bundle, and I will talk to you all later. Goodbye.